In this video, we're going to be looking at the Sigma Telegram Sniper Bot, and I'm going to be telling you the best settings so that you can be successful sniping with Sigma, as well as buying coins normally. Now, if you haven't yet used out Sigma, I will actually include an invitation link in the description down below. So you can go ahead and click on that link, which will open up this Telegram page, which will allow you to start using the bot. Now, if it's your first time using Sigma, I have actually made a different video which you can watch, which will guide you through the process of setting up your wallet, as well as how to get started. But this video is going to cover the best settings. So once you've opened up Sigma and you're on this menu, you can actually go and click this settings button here. And it will give us a few different options, but we just want to go down to presets first. Now these presets will basically allow us to have preset buttons, which can help us buy certain amounts easier, as well as change your gas. So for example, if we clicked on buy buttons here, these are the ones that are default. So this will be 0.1 Ethereum, 0.2 Ethereum, 0.5 Ethereum, and then one whole Ethereum. So some people may be trading with smaller size and they may not be wanting to put one Ethereum into a trade. So you can actually click on these to change them and you can just change this to whatever you want. Now, if you're using Sigma to buy manually, I'd recommend you change these as if you're buying manually, you need to usually buy quite quick. So if these buttons are already set to an amount that you're going to buy, it's going to make the whole process easier and it's going to save you time when buying coins. Now, you can also do this with the gas as well, but personally, I don't really use this that much unless I'm sniping. So I'm just going to leave this alone. But if you wanted to up the gas to even higher than five, you can do that. But it's going to be quite expensive. So from there, we can go back to the menu and we're now going to go into the manual buyer. So when it comes to the best settings for manual buying, there isn't really much to change. Most of these settings will be good. But the only thing I would recommend you change is the slippage. Because by default, it won't be set. So personally, if I'm manually buying, I usually put it to around seven. And that means the price can move up to 7% before it fails our transaction. So if we try and buy and the coin moves up 6%, it will buy. But if we put in the transaction and it went up 10%, the transaction would fail since 10% is over 7%. Now you can up the gas as well, but for manual buying, I don't really recommend doing that. I don't think there's really any point. So for the rest of these settings, we can pretty much keep these the same. So now onto the best settings for sniping. So when I'm sniping, what I like to do personally is up the gas. So if it's a hype launch, you want to basically up the gas a lot more because it will mean there's more chance of your transaction going through. But what I find works the best for me is setting it to one. And I also set the slippage to 100. And that actually means that there's no slippage. So this means that the price can move up as much as it wants and you will still buy without getting a failed transaction. So if you're going for a really hype launch, this can be bad because if tons of people are sniping it at the same time, it could end up meaning that you buy the very top However, if your slippage isn't high enough, it may also mean that you miss the snipe and you miss out on a launch. So what I like to do is go for smaller, less hyped launches, and I set the slippage to 100. But of course, if you don't want to risk that, you can drop the slippage down lower, but it may mean that your snipe will fail. But other than that, those are pretty much all the settings that I have set for Sigma bot. Because this is the best base telegram bot, in my opinion. And you can have a lot of success looking for new pairs on base and trying to snipe them if they'd look good. So this has been my video showing you the Sigma Telegram Sniper Bot best settings. Hopefully you found this video helpful and if you did, please comment down below to say I helped you out. Thanks for watching.